approaching the ring from Battle Creek, Michigan, Rob Van Diver. Wow, this arena has come completely unglued. Sometimes a superstar just has that special connection with the fans, and that's exactly what we're seeing here tonight. Let's just call it for what it is, an all-out brawl. This match is not an impressive display of holds. This is a war, a war where two men are going to attempt to tear each other limb from limb and pulverize one another beyond recognition. And King, we have a front row seat. Into the tie-up they go, but Who's going to end up with the upper hand? Well, I think it's too difficult to tell, even from this angle. Tell us about Harvey. The sky's the limit. I see a lot of main events in the future. He's simply reminding him that he's here. Collar and elbow tie up here. Oh, this is critical for a competitor in establishing themselves in the match. This up. This one will be over in no time. You can't put a price tag on landing that perfect strike, and that nailed him. Going for the cover, and he breaks the cover, forcing the referee to stop the count. Well, that's just not enough to get the job done. Oh, out of nowhere! Adding insult to potential injury there. A brutal clothesline catches in the perfect spot. Ouch. Uh, oh, man. That'll leave your neck hurting for a while. Not today. Too fast. It's a good old-fashioned butt whooping. Yeah, that's exactly what we're witnessing. A butt whooping. Oh! The small of the back is absorbing a great deal of punishment here. Oh, no. Wait a minute, Cole. What's he going to do here? From our vantage point, it doesn't even look like a sweat has been broken. I'm thinking to avoid that. Doing whatever it takes to win. Can you blame him? Getting some air here. I need some too after sitting next to you. Talk about catching a beating. Acrobatic maneuvers like that require special type of skills. Yeah, that really makes me jealous. Quick thinking to avoid that. Ooh. Not today, too fast. We're looking at complete domination here. There may be no fighting out of this. And that's the sound of rolling thunder. That might have just been my stomach. And he kicks out. And he lives to fight again. He's still not through. Oh, and he missed that one. God, that's got to hurt. Yeah, you're not doing any damage with swings like that, but keep doing it. The freeze may give him a cold. Look at this. There it is. 
The side effect. Oh, this one's almost over. And into the cover. And he breaks the cover, forcing the referee to stop the count. Well, that's just not enough to get the job done. There's a punch worthy of the greatest heavyweights of the time. Yeah, that looked like a Mike Tyson or Muhammad Ali shot. Whoa. Quick thinking to avoid that. Two. Back between the ropes. So damaging. That type of speed is so hard to contain. Whoa, don't get up. Domination here. He almost makes that look easy. There's going to be a lot of offense in this match. Wouldn't have it any other way. That's what I love to see. Great match here, but if you missed any of the matches from this week, go to WWE.com to catch up on all the action. I go to WWE.com. Hoping to end it early. Here's hoping. Two. Oh, look at that. He managed to get a shoulder up. Well, like they say, Cole, timing is everything. He's in big trouble. Not today. Too fast. The human spine's not meant to bend that way. Oh, the longer he stays in this, the closer he is to losing the match. Man, somebody's going to be sore in the morning. Stay down. Stay down. Oh, out of nowhere. Absolutely no quit in them tonight. Oh, wow. It's going to take a lot to change the tide of this one. What great action we've had in this match. <laughs> I'm absolutely loving it, Cole. Come on, aren't you? Look how excited you are. The shoulders are down. Two. These guys are giving it their all here tonight, not just to entertain the fans, but to ultimately walk away with the win. Dishing out some serious punishment here. Even if you can get back to your feet after a move like that, at this stage of the match, you're still struggling to find your balance. That's what you call impact. Oh, no kidding. That was vicious. This should do it right there. I think this is it. A wild overhead punch wreaking havoc in here. No kidding. That shot came out of nowhere. That's it. He's done. Oh, that's called gold. We got a cover. The tension, the drama. This is electric. Look in the back of my arm, Cole. Good sleeper hold. Tough move to get out of.
taking on some moderate offense here. Going to need to start playing a little better defense. We're looking at complete domination here. This match has taken so much out of this guy. He's not going to give up. But man, this has been physical. He takes to the air. Wow. And this has got to be it. Yeah, maybe. People have been wanting to see these guys go at it for a long time, and by the sound of this crowd, I think they're getting what they wanted. Oh, out of nowhere! The back is the largest area on the human body, and thus, always a target. I know what you mean. You know, I've got a weak back. How long did you have that? Well, about a week back. He's too busy bragging and boasting the battle into this matchup. Thinking to avoid that. Seems like these guys are letting out a lot of pent-up frustration tonight. Oh my, Van Diver comes up big there. Van Diver looks absolutely focused in there tonight. The fight's being brought right to it. This should do it right there. I think this is it. One, two, three. What a win. Man, he's got to feel great. Here's your winner. A big singles victory here tonight. You know, without a doubt, he is among the most dominant guys on the WWE roster right now. It'll be interesting to see the fallout following this big singles win here tonight. What's this? Well, here we go. The fight is on. Making it look easy. Some very opportunistic offense here. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. Oh, that's devastating. I'm not sure I can watch this. Not going to win many matches with that move. Well, that missed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. Knocked the breath out with a crushing kick to the gut. Oh, I didn't be able to breathe for a week. Well, we're on the move here. Oh, man. How much damage did that cause to the neck? I'm not sure I can watch this. Ray Wyatt reverses it. No, oh, wait, nice reversal. Oh, he looks With all that buildup, it's sad to see it end like that. This one is waved off. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match, and it is for the ECW Tag Team Championship. Wow, this arena has come completely unglued. I'm really looking forward to this one. So much on the line in this championship match.
You know, sometimes a superstar just has that look in his eye. And this is one of those times. Put those tag ups away, ref. We're gonna do this one tornado style. And introducing the challengers, Tyson Kidd and Zack Ryder. And their opponents, they are the ECW Tag Team Champions, Luke Harper and Eric Rowan. The Wyatt Family. So much anticipation, and it all comes down this. The tornado tag is underway. Any strategy you would utilize in this type of match, Kid? Well, so many things are different about this type of match than a normal tag match. But one thing you don't want to do is leave your partner alone and get a two-on-one advantage. He's got to be vigilant about not taking any more damage to the neck. Oh, out of nowhere! Not every move is designed to get the fans off their feet. There's definitely facial damage. I just wonder if anything's broken. Yeah, he's going to have a Roman nose. Going to roam all over his face. I would imagine when a superstar thinks about Eric Rowan's moves like the avalanche, the fallaway slam, the frog splash, and the big boot, it makes them think twice if they want to have a match with that monster or not. At least it should. Well, what's your take right now on Eric Rowan? A win for Zack Ryder here would successfully mark the culmination of a long journey to the top. Looking for us right now, which is good. You got to wonder how much longer that can last, though. Here's somebody who's willing to do just a about anything to get to the top. I like it. That's the way it should be. This match will have a lot of big moves. One question will be, who will capitalize on those moves the best? And who will capitalize on those moves the earliest? Oh, and did you hear the impact? You know, Michael, we've talked about this before. Eric Rowan stands six foot eight and weighs over 300 pounds. 
Imagine what an inverted backbreaker from him feels like. Or a scoop slam. Or a shoulder block. I'm not even going to think about a clothesline. Oh, oh, wow. We may have discovered his favorite move. You think? He seems to use it often enough. Well, we're on the move here. No, hold on there. Ryder needs to regroup. He's in big trouble. And the offensive display by Luke Harper. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these date out. Ooh. That's how you move up the ladder here in WWE. King, when we're talking about an offensive assault at the gruesome hands of Eric Rowan, we're talking about one maneuver, one hold, one strike, being more disastrous than the next. And any of those can put away an opponent just like that. Yeah, I gotta agree with you there, Cole. I'm almost hesitant to mention this, but I think as time goes on, Eric Rowan's just gonna add more torturous forms of offense to his repertoire. Then what? I don't even want to think about it. Wow, he's still there after that. Zack Ryder is a force within the ring. The things this guy can do are simply amazing. You have to assume that tonight is one of the favorite nights of the year for the referees, right? I mean, there's practically no rules to enforce. The only thing they have to worry about is declaring a winner. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Look, Tyson Kidd. He looks like he's got this. Of all the potentially career-ending moves Luke Harper destroys an opponent with, nothing is more frightening to see than his discus clothesline. When you see Harper's 275-pound frame begin its motion, the clothesline is one of the most punishing WWE has ever seen. Uh-oh, big move coming. Oh, wait, nice reversal. Tyson Kidd has his eyes set on his target. We know what Zack Ryder called a resounding move by Tyson Kidd. The shoulders are down! Harper just continues to attack with those deranged eyes of his. He keeps coming at you with that brute force. As crazed as Luke Harper is, he is human. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. Oh, it's a slaughter, all right. Luke Harper's discus clothesline is so dangerous, he can finish an opponent off with it any time. Just when he seems to be down, Luke Harper spins, strikes, and Eric Rowan getting it done. Just making his presence. Hey, the shoulders are down! And the shoulders up in time. Well, as long as it's up before that three count, that's all that matters. Tyson Kidd's great endurance keeping him going here. And now, Kidd pushing forward. Ow! Inside the ring. Unleashing it for the second time now. There's going to be a lot of offense in this match. Wouldn't have it any other way. That's what I love to see. He's got him hooked. Going for break. And how much abuse can that arm withstand? Zack Ryder scores with a tremendous move. Going for the cover. Two. Eric Rowan is sizing up the situation. I can't tell you how many victims have suffered the same fate. The shoulders are down. 